gentlemen, please welcome the greatest footballer on the planet, Cristiano Ronaldo. <laughs> so, uh, what are your estimation of how it might go, and what are your feelings about the result either way? To be honest, I think you're going to win. Messi is going to win this year. Yeah, but you know, it's FIFA. You're just... <laughs> just... <laughs> 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 I don't have rivals. I don't have. We have a normal relationship. We share this stage there in FIFA eight years. Yeah. No one's did that in the past. It's only only us. Yeah. So it's good. I have a good relationship with him. He played for one club. I play for another club. He wanted the best for him. I want the best for me. We are not. Uh, home friends, but you know, we respect each well, that, other. That looks like a very good relationship, right? <laughs> 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 what is he wearing? <laughs> Cristiano, what do you think of this suit? Unbelievable. <laughs> you In know, a good way or a bad way? A good way, of oh, course. Oh, thank you. <laughs> well, your English now is very good. Well, I try my best. Yeah. Well. <laughs> uh, and this isn't me just being polite, it is very good. Um, <laughs> But uh, when you first came, I guess it wasn't as good. And certainly, I, I have spoken it all my life, but I find it hard to understand Alex Ferguson sometimes. So <laughs> that must have been difficult for you at first. But I still don't understand him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. Because in the beginning, you have, I, I had to translate. <laughs> a Brazilian man. So you had to translate that of for... Of course. What, for all British people or just for Alex Ferguson? <laughs> Well, basically, only yeah. for him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Also <laughs> coming to me and to my team, say, listen, I'm interested to do a documentary about you. I'm in shock. I say, a movie about me? He said, why me? Why not Lionel Messi? Yeah. <laughs> I understand him because they, they're looking for the best player in the world. So, so. <laughs> well, I did the movie for my fans. As you know, the guy who have more followers, it's me. Not by coincidence, it's because People like me, yeah. probably. Well, you can't, say that, you can't say that often enough about yourself, of course. <laughs> but it's true. Yeah. So I did. <laughs> no, it is true, I know, I know it's true. <laughs> so I did for them, yeah. for my fans. But Cristiano, I asked him, because Cristiano, you don't watch many uh, films, you don't watch much TV, but you told me you'd heard of Doctor Who. Mm -hmm. Did you, have you seen David as Doctor Who? No. OK. <laughs> Uh, you see Ronaldo with his son there, it's a very funny uh, moment there where he says, is he serious that he wants to be a goalkeeper, do you know? Yes. <laughs> and this is... Uh... Gonna be a huge problem for me. Okay, yeah. <laughs> There's, I don't know, have you seen uh, Wayne Rooney's little boy, who seems like a lovely little boy? Mm -hmm. He went out to play recently and he had a tattoo on his arm. Not an actual tattoo, I don't think. I think it was a transfer, but who knows with the Rooney's. So, uh, <laughs> have a look at this. Okay, so you see what was on his arm there? There you go. Now, if your little boy came home with Rooney on his arm, <laughs> would, would that be cool? Would that be okay? No problem. Okay? Yes, no problem. What about if you had Messi on his arm? No problem. Okay. <laughs> if you will, will do that, it's because he's smart. He knows he's good players. That's fair enough. That's a good point. He is. Yeah, that's a lovely answer. Um, would you like any more children? Yes. A few more. How many are you planning? I want. Three, four more. I think I think maybe you had a list. I yeah. think you were. <laughs> but one thing that amazed me is, is that she says in the film, and you're there, that you were an unwanted child. She didn't want to keep you. Mm -hmm. Now that must be a shocking thing. The first time you hear that, that must be no. Come on. <laughs> but for you to hear that, I know I know it happens a lot. Don't but change I mean, nothing in my mind. Nothing. You see in the film how stressed she gets. She's very involved in your career. And when she sees you playing. I mean, it's almost too much for her sometimes. Too much. Yeah, and she takes tranquilizers to help her get through this. How does that affect you, though, knowing you're playing, but knowing she is going through that as well? Does that ever figure in your mind during a match, or...? No, I just uh, make a rule. Big games, you know, she cannot watch. <laughs> it's true. Yeah. I don't take her to my box, or I put it someone in home to go walk with her uh, when, ga when games start. Until it's, it's over. It's the, it's the solution. If you had a friend who didn't show love to your mother, respect to your mother, how long would they stay a friend for? They're never going to be uh, with me, next to me. Because they have a uh, security and make him sleep, so... <laughs> <laughs> so don't mess with mama. Yeah. Okay. Your mother 
is so central and important to your life. But he does not have that relationship with his mother. Mm -hmm. Surely that must concern you. For me, it's not, it's not a problem. How you see in the world, many kids don't have mom, don't have dads, or dads die, or moms die, and they, they beat him up. Christian have a dad, unbelievable dad, have grandfather, <laughs> grandmother, have support of my family. Yeah. Great. Some points in the life, it's private. And people have to respect the privacy of the people, you know? When Christian is going to grow up, I'm always, always going to say the truth to him because he deserves, because it's my son. But I'm not going to say because people want me to say. Uh, I guess, how many cars did your father have when you were five? <laughs> yeah, small cars, yeah, many. Okay. No. Toys, but did he, he have toys. an actual car? No, no. He no. didn't even have a car. No. How many cars do you have right now? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> That's a big difference. That's a good honesty. But for me, in my mind, the way I'm thinking, it's all about education. If you will give good education, it will be strong. You will know and you will not appreciate the things. I cannot avoid to show him a good car, a good houses, uh, a good quality of life. You cannot avoid, you know? Yeah, because you have that. Of exactly. Course, you have exactly. That, yeah. I cannot avoid. What I have to do it? If you will be in my shoes, what are you going to do? It's all about education. You have to give good education. I cannot do anything uh, more. What about uh, other aspects of your personal life? What about, is there a special someone in your life right now? A few. <laughs> <laughs> honesty, honesty, honesty. <laughs> OK. And, and of the few specials... I have to figure it out. Yeah, which is... Any, you figure it out, OK, do they know they're competing? Someone's know, yeah. OK. <laughs> you must be exhausted. <laughs> Obviously, you're... May I say this? You're a very beautiful man. Well... <laughs> <laughs> ah, normal. No, this is normal. You're a so. good, you're a good-looking piece of meat. Yeah. Okay. That's right. There, look yeah. at that. Not bad, eh? <laughs> Bet you in the CR7 pants, of course. Yeah. It's weird because they they look different on me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, would you ever come back to Manchester United? Yeah. As I say many times. I'm very comfortable in Real Madrid now. I feel happy. Well, that's kind of where you always wanted to be, really, wasn't it? Yeah, of course. But as people know, I like Manchester United. I love that club. But future, nobody knows. But right now, I feel good and I feel happy in Real Madrid. Yeah. In my mind, I want to finish in the top level. I want to finish with dignity. So good, you know, in a good club. Yeah. It doesn't mean that to go to uh, USA or Qatar or Dubai, it's not good, but I don't see myself... You wouldn't want that for you? No. Mr Cristiano Ronaldo!